Hey guys, in this video I am going to show you how to book an appointment for knowledge test or the written test for driver's license. So go to Google and uh, type DMV CA which is the DMV California and uh, choose the first link or the second link anything is fine and uh, this is the DMV uh, website and uh, on that choose appointments in appointments you need to choose the first one service advisor and then in service advisor you need to choose this one driver's license renewal okay but we are not going to renew the driver's license we need to book an appointment for the written examination so there is an option called no I need an appointment choose that this first option is for uh, someone who wants to walk into the DMV office they can go for this they'll uh, provide a barcode you need to print it out and uh, you can show it in the um, DMV so we need not worry about that let's get this one get an appointment click on that in this page you'll see two options choose the first one real ID driver's license so uh, your real ID is an ID card which is accepted by the federal government for example if you want to board a flight you need not carry your passport instead you can just show your uh, driver's license which has a real ID in it so here's how the real ID is incorporated into your uh, driver's license at DMV they will collect your fingerprints your uh, social your ID proof your address proof and they will incorporate those data into your driver's license so this is how uh, real id incorporated driver's license would look like so if you look into the top right there is a uh, star symbol right so that means your uh, driver's license is incorporated with a real id and uh, this uh, real id is specific to california state so if you are in other state this symbol might varies according to your state and uh, this video is specific to california's driver's license click on the first link and uh, you'll be taken to a page where you need to choose your uh, DMV office location so um, you'll have all the location listed out and uh, you can choose any of the office office location so I am choosing Sacramento and uh, click continue once you click continue it will be taken to a page where you need to enter your uh, first name last name and then your uh, phone number and uh, after phone number this field is for uh, choosing a specific date for appointment say for example if you want a date at the end of the month or if you want a date for next month you can uh, pick a date available dates from the calendar and uh, you can schedule an appointment so for now we need not uh, pick a date let's leave this uh, field blank and uh, continue with uh, uh, the default option so let's leave it blank and uh, the next option is for receiving a notification through SMS or through call so I'm clicking submit and uh, it will check for the available appointment dates it will show up the first available appointment though so the first available appointment is on uh, Friday May 21st 2021 and the time they have given and they also uh, have given your phone number and I'm clicking the confirm appointment and look your appointment has been scheduled now so they have given uh, the confirmation ID too so this is how you need to schedule an appointment online and also you can cancel the appointment if you need so go to appointments on the home page and then choose view or cancel appointment and I enter your uh, data here my first name last name and the phone number and uh, click continue so here is the uh, appointment data in the I'm gonna click cancel appointment and finish so your appointment has been cancelled now so this is how you can cancel and schedule an appointment you can also schedule an appointment by calling the customer care and uh, that's all about it guys thanks for watching